I do want to welcome back our Chief Meteorologist Jason Simpson. You were gone um, for a short amount of time, but uh, we're just we're happy that you're back and, and that your, your daughter's okay and she's recovering. Yeah, uh, Wednesday night, uh, usually I get a, a chance as long as right. there's no storms to go home for yeah. dinner. And Wednesday night when I was home for dinner, Shelby was out in the backyard. We think a copperhead got her and she's, she's doing well, but uh, we got her home from the hospital about uh, almost three hours ago. So she's home and she's resting and getting everything that she could possibly want. Cookies, donuts, whatever it might Anything, be. Yeah. All, you know, all the rules are gone right now. <laughs> uh, it, it, when you get to something like that, I never have uh, experienced anything quite like what she has gone through. Those snake bites are very, very serious. and. What makes this even more interesting is we had a snake expert on early this Wednesday week. morning yeah, that morning because talking I was about this exact thing yeah. and it was around sunset wow. when that copperhead was out there in an area where we'd never seen a right. snake before. Look out. You yeah. never think yeah. it Look could out. happen to you, right? right? And it could be hiding in the grass. You just have to really watch out, probably yeah. especially this time of year. Yeah, well, I, I got to say a special thank you to the folks at Grandview yeah. as well as Children's and UAB. Yeah. She was taken to Grandview initially and then uh, they moved her up to Children's and Poison Control here in Alabama. Just an epic job. Dr. Sarah Marshall is incredible at UAB, so we appreciate everything that they do. We're happy she's uh, okay. We've been bombarding sure, you with sure. questions <laughs> since they came back. We're, we're happy that she's all right tonight. Yes, so she, she's doing great. She's going to be okay. <laughs>